First up on our list is the Nike Infinity React. Nike conducted a study that compared the Infinity React to its own Nike Structure 22. The results indicated that the Nike Infinity React reduced the risk of injury by 52% in comparison. Stability features include guide rails to add support whenever your feet roll inward or outward. It has a thick slab of React foam providing great protection, responsiveness, and durability. This is a great shoe for those who slightly over prone. Second, we got the Brooks Journal GTS 20 up on our list. Similar to the Nike Infinity React, it has guide rails to correct over pronation. There is softer DNA loft foam in the heel and more responsive DNA by mogul foam in the forefoot. The upper is made of a 3D mesh upper and doesn't have as many overlays. The heel to toe drop is 12mm which is very high. Lastly, the forefoot is a bit roomier compared to other shoes, so if you have a wider foot, then this shoe will be good for you. The A6 Gel Kayana 27 also made its way to this list. This shoe probably has the most technological features out of any stability shoe out there. One of these features includes the heel cup. The plastic heel cup helps stabilize the heel during the transition from heel to toe. Second, there's a plastic piece on the outsole called the trussic system. The trussic system prevents the shoe from twisting, helping correct over pronation. Third, Gel cushioning is both in the heel and the forefoot, providing a slightly softer feel. Fourth, there is a medial post to correct over pronation as well. The Saucony Hurricane 22 is up next on this list. It boasts Power Run Plus Foam, which provides a lighter and softer feel with exceptional energy return. The upper is plush with a super soft ankle collar and tongue. And yes, this shoe has a medial post. Lastly, we got the Hoka One One Arahi 4. The Hoka Arahi is different than the previous models we covered because it is a little bit lighter and more versatile. 